is up guys it is scumpy and today i am bringing you guys a 40 plus kill tdm gameplay uh, i did this because i was actually challenged by a subscriber to try and get 40 plus kills in a tdm match so here it is i got it on lockdown using the acr it's a pretty sweet gameplay but today i want to really want i really want to stray away from my from my gameplay commentary and try something else out and today i'm going to be talking about my personal life a little bit sort of an introduction to you guys getting to know me but let's start it off here i am seth or scump abner and i'm currently 16 years old i'm a junior in high school and i attend cumberland valley and i live in mechanicsburg pa i don't live in mechanicsburg pa but that's like the biggest town that i can describe where i live but <clears throat> I've been gaming hard for about five to six years now. I haven't been playing competitively, competitively for five to six years. I've been playing competitively for probably two to three years, starting really at the end of Call of Duty 4. Uh, I've always had a passion for video games. They, they just, there's something to do whenever I'm not bored. I don't understand how people, I don't understand how people can like function without playing video games at least sometime. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're just a way. They relieve stress for me. They take my mind off of everything that's going on in the real world, and I just really enjoy playing them to burn off stress, like I just said. But I have always been a really comical kid. Uh, in all my classes, uh, I used to be the class clown. I've matured a little bit now in school. Still a little bit of a goofball, but still. I always used to be the class clown in like fifth grade. I'd be doing stupid shit, and the teachers would just hate me for it. Uh, I've I've never I've never really focused on my grades too much. Um, in ninth grade, I actually played football for the freshman football team, and I started both ways. And for some reason, I thought that I didn't need to get good grades because I would be playing football and I would get a scholarship somewhere. But football well, has been my passion for a very long time in my life. I've been playing, I had been playing for about eight to nine years. I actually quit just uh, my freshman year. My freshman year was my last year. I ended up getting hurt. And I couldn't really bounce back from that. I didn't really enjoy it anymore. I would be going to the gym five days a week. I'd be doing agility, agility training Tuesdays and Thursdays, and I'd be lifting hard Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I had been doing that for about a year and a half. And I used to weigh about 160 pounds. But then I dropped to 150 pounds. But now I'm really into personal fitness. Uh, me and a couple of my friends go to the gym every day. Not every day. We go Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I've been doing that consistently for about a month. About a month and a couple weeks now. And I, I mean, the lifestyle change has been really awesome. It's just, I don't know. It's coming home and just going straight to video games got boring after a while. I was just overplaying them. I'd be playing for hours on end right when I got home from school. So switching it up and starting to go to the gym was really, really something new, uh, a new lifestyle. And I, I do enjoy it a lot. But I've gained about nine pounds since I started going again. Um, so I'm about at 156, 156 pounds now. And I don't like whenever I hear people stereotyping the gamer as know a nerd the competitive gamer is a nerd and no life like you play this game so much uh, I think of it sort of like football I think of it sort of like baseball which were the two sports that I primarily played but I think of it like if you're naturally talented at something it doesn't take a tremendous amount of time to be good at that thing you know what I'm saying like it doesn't it doesn't require the amount of practice that people really think that it takes like I I practice maybe two hours a night tops with my team and this isn't even every night like we, we set up show matches and we'll play for about two or three hours tops and that's our practice until we all get on again which is never a definite thing we're never gonna definitely be getting on so I mean it's not like I'm sitting here playing this game non-stop but I don't know I just keep my shot warm and after I get home from the gym, I eat and I shower, and then I try and hop on the game, try and get these gameplays, try and get these commentaries. But right now, my life is sort of hectic. It's really hard to keep up with all this, especially with school. 
because of this stupid ass class that I'm taking. Nice but I'm gonna make this a two part commentary. If you enjoyed the video, give me a like and a favorite. And if you wanna follow me on Twitter, go to www.twitter.com slash apex underscore scum.